This shift in mindset was critical when I realized I was a people pleaser and I wanted to change. You have to understand the stages of grief before you can understand this principle. The first is denial. You're probably going to realize that you have a problem with something and then you're going to deny it exists. I'm not that bad, nothing's wrong with me, etc. And it's not unhealthy. We have to cushion the blow emotionally. The second is anger. How could I let this happen? This isn't fair. Blame also shows up here because anger allows us to not have to immediately take responsibility until we're ready. The third is bargaining. If I do this thing, can I have it back the way I was? Maybe if I give a little room on my boundaries, I can have that person back in my life. We literally ask the universe what we have to do to go back to the way of living that wasn't good for us. The fourth is depression, where we realize that we have truly lost our former selves, that who we were and who we're becoming are no longer aligned. The loss has become unavoidable and real. Fifth and potentially most important is acceptance. Don't get confused. You're still going to feel the loss. You're still going to feel the pain. It's that you'll be no longer resisting what is real. That you can find peace in the pain and begin the process of moving forward. This is why I have the free radical acceptance guide. I want anyone to be able to experience massive change when they hit the final stage.